Yeah, answered that question. That's pretty cool, huh? That I put the question up there. You guys like that, huh? You like that there? I figured that out myself. Christian didn't even know. All right, so we are on the button here. There's a raise to 1600 in front of us. Let's make it. We're going to 4800. Making it three times from the button. You'll notice when you play six handed, it's a lot more aggressive action. There's a lot more opens because you're you know, in better positions, a lot more three betting. I will tell you at the end of this hand, what we have, oh boy, we have an all in from Wakus. All right, I don't see myself folding this. There is rebuys left. I think we have to go with this. I have a feeling he has ace king, which we beat. So, okay, he had ace king. See, I can still do it online too. Keep it low. Keep it low, baby. Keep it low. Keep it low. Keep it low for the show. Low for the show. That's what's up. That's a good boy. That's a good boy. Eat some of that. Yeah. How you like that? Huh? I said I think he has ace king. So good. It's crazy. Oh, Glanciero Ole. All right, hold on. I'll answer that question just a second before after I limp in here from the small blind against the super aggressive Sammy Twiz. Plays these spots very aggressive too. He did not this time. I'm going to check over to Sammy Twiz. <laughs> Jerry Tucker says he can see my cards in the reflection of my glasses. Oh, yeah? I doubt it. You've got a pretty good eye if you can do that. So we got a bet here from Sammy Twiz. And we are going to call. Turn is a jack. I'm going to check once again. Over to Sammy Twiz. The Twiz. So his range here is really wide. He checked in the big blind. So he could have, he could have anything, you know. So we don't really know what he has. We know what we have. So what we're going to do is we're going to press the call button. River is a nine. We're going to check to the river, check to the uh, aggressor, Sammy Twiz. 11-7 in the pot. Let's see how many, how much he's got for this one. Interesting spot here. He's betting 7,000. All right, this feels very much like two pair. Like he did flop eights up or maybe made two pair, but we floated. We were trying to steal this pot with a check, check turn and then a, you know, a bit bluff on the river, but we hit the jack. So I have a jack and that's too good to fold against this player. So I'm going to call and he has Jackson force. So, okay. Unfortunate there that uh, we hit that jack and no 10 on the river. It was close to a nine. Could have won with an eight too. Eight would have won it for us. Okay, I had four, six offsuit, and I looked at the clock. There's only like a minute left before the re-entry is over. So I felt like, okay, I'm either just going to pick up these chips right now or, you know, be able to rebuy, double up, whatever. So let's see here. I think, basically, let me just make sure that I do this right. So we have not re-entered. We have two left, about a minute left to do so. So essentially, we have almost like a free, free jam here in a way, if we have something good. All right, I think this is it. This is the end of the rebuy period. I believe it. you're allowed through the break. Let me see. Um, I'm gonna go max all in, because that's what we've been doing in this spot. And Sammy Twiz is gonna think about it, and then he's gonna call with a, okay, we have a seven. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh, baby. See how lucky we are? Sorry, Sammy. That was pretty ugly. That was actually a pretty normal play anyway with ace-seven from the small blind. Sammy Twiz was unlucky to have a hand that he had to call with with the ace-queen. And we're back to 57,000. We're going to leave you hey, here. Delay says we'd rather see, see your whole stack. cards with delay. And I'd rather have 20 billion, gazillion, gazillion, gazillion dollars. Well, you're not going to, Ed Lay. Here you go right here. I'm going to say you're not going to see my whole cards. I understand what you'd rather have. But I told you I'm going to tell you at the end of the hand what I have. And this is live live. So there. Okay? I mean, this, this is it. Okay? Here. I'm going to defend my big line. I'm going to check over to PT Dodge 250. What a day for a daydream. He checked. So now we are going to bet 2700 2700 is bet from the big line. He called quickly. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now it's where we bet 6,500. A little over half pot, right around half pot. River 10. 
do 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 what's he got right now he folded all right i will tell you what i had it was a big turn card for me i had the ace of clubs the ten of clubs i turned a flush draw ace high could have been good i was going to bet the river most likely anyway if i missed try to get him off a better ace high luckily we hit the 10 so then we turn that into a value bet how y'all doing Dean eggs in the house playing pot limit omaha eight or better yeah so plo eight or better if you don't understand what the hell's going on with this game, it's uh, as simple as it's Omaha, right? If you know Omaha, that means you got to use two cards out of your hand and three from the board, okay? But in this game, it's Omaha high and low. <laughs> so you you can use two cards for high, right, to make your best high hand. And you can also make use two cards for low. And they don't have to be the same two cards. It could be any two cards for high, any two cards for low. And to for a low to qualify, you must have five cards, eight or better. Okay. Is that confusing? As f yeah. It's also pot limit. So there you go. <laughs> of really, really top designers all on one website. And that's rocking. You love it too. You love when I order things there. Oh, it's the best. It's so like, you, so cool. there was that chick on there, Hannah. Oh, he's obsessed with this chick. Whatever. Hannah Ann. <laughs> her name, Hannah Ann, right? Yeah. She wore a lot of the Revolve stuff. And then Amanda bought some because I thought it was nice. I all bought right. stuff way before that. He has no yeah. idea. We are going all in, honey. Okay. All in. Against so freaking Terry Cats. I got you, buddy. Don't you on, dare hit on, a fucking heart. Don't you dare hit a fucking heart. No low, heart. low, 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 low. Yes. Scooper duper. Eat some of that, buddy, if you're watching. <laughs> I know who that is. Yeah, you've What's been you saying doing? it. You're me with that. Come on, bro. All right, let's answer Nicolas Clurcides' question, which is coming in from, looks like, the Facebook. Okay, well, he's asking, you know, my opinion on GTO play. So GTO, for those of you that don't know what the heck that is, stands for Game Theory Optimal. It's a short form for it. Essentially what it means is, you know, playing theoretically like unexploitably. So no matter what you do, nobody can exploit you, okay? Now, imagine rock, paper, scissors, right? So if you play rock, paper, scissors, I'm sure you played that game. So if you play GTO, that means you would play 33% of each, okay? So you play 33% rock, paper, scissors. And, you know, that's a strategy that will guarantee you cannot lose. However, however, get this. If you play that strategy, can you win? No. Because it doesn't matter what anybody else throws. Because you will be breaking even based on your, you know, thing. So the way that I look at it, and it's a good analogy for poker, is you want to use GTO principles and understand game theory. And then always look to exploit from that. And understand that, like, okay, against the perfect robot... This is what I should do, but I'm not playing the perfect robot. I'm playing against this guy right here who does this, this, and this, and he calls too much or he folds too much. So, so, uh, yeah. That answers your question. I would imagine. I mean, question I still like the older dudes. I like, um, see, <laughs> I like, yeah, it's true. Brad Pitt and, <laughs> and Johnny Clooney. And Johnny Clooney. Johnny Clooney. <laughs> Johnny Clooney. George Clooney. Johnny Clooney. God, you threw me off with the daddy issues. Come on, man. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I like the older guys. Michael T. Hey, Daniel, have you ever been on Tilt? Okay, so we raised it up here and got... What the hell happened to the software? What the hell? Oh, f Software froze? The software froze. WSOP. God dang it. This happened earlier today, too. All right, he's back. What the hell? This is so tilting. Oh no, not again, you stupid f software. The f this fuck, unbelievable tilt. What is going on, man? No harm, no foul. A little bit frustrating when that happens. It gets you a little scary, you know, you're a little nervous. Question coming in from, again, the software. I mean, what is going on, dude? We got over here. It's on me? What the f man? This motherfucker. Come on. Oh, All right. What happened now? Just keep folding me. It says I'm disconnected. I'm not disconnected. You. What's okay. Hey, buddy. I'm sorry. Damn it. Both dogs hurt me. All. They hate when I yell. It's okay. It's a good boy. That's, I got to do the good friendly voice. Damn it. No. Stay classy, San Diego. No, I lose my shit. When internet problems, I my like number one. Well, you know, everyone has to have patience uh, for certain, like, 
What the hell did I win? What, what's going on right now? I'm in the big blind. <laughs> this software, I don't even know what's happening right now. I'm in the big blind with cards. And that thing's caught up. This thing is mother fucking shit. I have zero patience for internet issues. I'm going to smash the computer. Steaming. You guys get to see me really. Yeah, someone asked me earlier if I ever go on tilt. Well, now you can see it. <laughs> Come on, bro. Come on. Come on. Come on. It's got me folding. Mother shit. I have Queen Jack of Hearts. Two pair. All right, I'm out of here. I'm too steamed up. This mother. This is, this, is, this, is, this is the pain of online poker. I'm going to see you guys later and, and try and figure out a plan B. Peace, y'all. Tilt. We will be back with you guys every day, 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. across all the platforms. I think that's it. Yeah. All right. See you guys.